Coach, we've got a story coming up on Jeremy Morgan. Uh, has had a really solid uh, freshman, sophomore year, looking good in his junior year. Defensively, he brings uh, a lot, but offensively, uh, looks like he's starting to step forward a little bit. Yeah, he's, he's different this year at the offensive end of the floor. There's no, there's no question. He, he spent a lot of time working on his jump shot. You know, that was one of the things we talked about. I talked about him getting more consistent with his jump shot, but also trying to, you know, you know working to expand his game offensively. And uh, we've been able to post him some. He's done some off the dribble. Uh, the consistency with that jump shot from the three-point line is, is very different and much better. And uh, he has, he's worked at it. And I, I think the most exciting thing for Jeremy and the most exciting thing for our program is we're not even close to there yet in terms of where he's going to be in a month, in two months. And I you know, looking forward to one more year with him. So we, we, uh, he's doing well. All right. Very high ceiling for this young man, Jeremy Morgan. At six feet five inches and a chiseled 200 pounds, you and I's Jeremy Morgan is one of the top athletes in the Missouri Valley Conference, and he brings an intensity that will match any opponent. Once we get on the court, he tends to flip a switch and it becomes all business. He's really competitive, hates to lose, and you gotta love that about a guy. Jeremy's gonna get after it. You know what you're gonna get from him. Um, every day he's gonna bring it in practice. Uh, he's gonna get on the floor during the game, during practice. Uh, he's gonna play his hardest. Jeremy has produced a ton of results. This season, he averages double figures and is shooting better than 50%. He's a top rebounder for you and I and has the second most assists. And he leads the entire league in steals. Defensively, I think Jeremy's as good as there is in our league. Uh, it's hard to find a guy with his length, uh, with his athleticism and his awareness on the floor. Um, you know, like the, the game that sticks out for me last year is the Illinois State game at their place when we went to a zone, which we really didn't cover a whole lot of, but just his, his anticipation, his instincts took over that game from a defensive standpoint. I think he had seven or eight deflections and steals and really just changed the game for us. While his defense has been his most accomplished attribute, Jeremy has always been well-rounded, even his first year at UNI, which landed him on the MVC All-Freshman team. Now as an upperclassman, he's looking to carry a bigger part of the offensive load. Yeah, in the offseason, um, I really got after um, the smaller parts of my game, like uh, the ball handling and uh, my footwork and um, adjusting my shot a little bit too. Uh, Coach Jake's been working with me on uh, holding my follow through every time just so I have a more consistent shot. Um, I tell a lot of people, you know, he's had a great freshman, sophomore year, and I'm not sure we've ever re really run a play for him offensively. We're going to need him to step up his game a little bit on the offensive end. It's, he has the ability to. You know, that being said, um, Jeremy could score one point, he could score 15. The, what he brings to us is amazing on both ends of the floor. Still to come, more with Coach Jacobson and the three-point shooting specialist for the Panther women's basketball team.